Rosendo just cut somebody's ha hand off. No way, really? You know Rosendo? No. He's that guy that always walks with a yellow t-shirt. Oh, okay. And, uh, and the beige pants. They cut his hand off? That guy cut somebody else's. Oh, jeez. With a machete. So he's, I think he's going to go to prison. Well, I would hope. And I really don't give He pulled a shotgun on me. Well, there you go. You don't need that. Uh, you know, and I didn't do anything wrong to him. Sometimes you don't have to. <laughs> uh, what do you call that when he goes around? Uh, um, not trauma, but the other one. When somebody does bad to you and they get it back, what is that called? Benjamin. No. The other one. I don't know. What are you doing? It's when somebody does bad to you. Karma. Karma. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. They'll come back and get you. It yeah. might not be tomorrow. It will. It might not be today. It might not be on next Friday. Hey. These ones. Stupid. Yeah. Life's too short to live like that, you know? I know. That's why I, st I don't I don't deal with anybody in this town. Just my wife, you know. And I, I drink by myself if I have to. I don't go hang around with stupid idiots. You don't go causing trouble. I come chase you with a stick or something. Yeah, you know, or worse. Or a gun or yeah. a run over. You kind of assume everybody's got a gun anymore. I'm gonna buy me a gun here next, next, this coming, well, probably this coming week or next, because there's too many weirdos in this town. I'm just gonna buy me a small 25. That's all you need to protect yourself. And I'll shoot him in the leg, or you know, I'm gonna kill him. Yeah. I'm gonna shoot him in the leg or something to protect myself or protect my wife. Yeah. My wife's got a taser. Really? And she, that'll drop a cow down, a full grown cow. Yeah, but you gotta be pretty close to it. Well, yeah. All you gotta do is do contact. Yeah. Drop it like a bomb right in there. But you know what? I didn't get that for her because these guys are out of here. I don't know who. I mean, just I'm not naming names. I'm not pointing fingers. And I tell my wife, don't point at anybody because you know what? I'm gonna call you a rat. She says, Oh, look, there goes those girls. There goes those guys. I said, Don't point. Just. Talk to me. I can see. I got eyes. You can see. Then they'll fuck try to get you back. Because right. You're acting like a rat. You know what I mean? Yeah. But it's not her fault. She, she's learning. How long have you been married? 38 years. Wow, congratulations. Thank you. That's nice, man. Yeah, I've known her since she was 15. Wow, good. And I, I'm surprised she's not here right now. She's taking care of her father because... Uh, she lost, uh, we lost my mother-in-law like two months ago. Yeah. So he's kind of going through hard times. Well, good for her. What she, family's for. She, yeah, that's what I say. You know, I say, you know I say, take care of your dad. What you gotta do. All right, man, well, God bless you. Hey, I'm gonna wait for that train, man. Is it gonna go this way? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna go sit down over here. Good I love trees. trains. I've loved trains since I was a kid. Well, living here, I'm, you're in a good spot, especially when the freight used to come through here. It's too bad oh, it I don't, anymore. They don't run very much anymore, huh? You know, like once a week, you know? Yeah. You, you, did you, me and my wife were the first ones to ride the rail runner. That's cool. Well, that was like, what, like 20 years ago almost? I don't know if 15? it's that long, but I think it's close to 15. I think it's 15, yeah, because uh, you were running it. They stopped over there at uh, 550. Yeah. And I said, hey, are you guys running the train today? No, we're just warming it up. We're just testing it. I said, but if you come back at 4 o'clock, I'll give you guys a ride to Albuquerque and we're back. Cool. <laughs> we're like, awesome. we'll be here at 4 o'clock, we told them. So we're the first, actually the first one, me and my wife, to ride the railroad. That's really good. That's cool. And he didn't charge us. No, I just gave you a ride, huh? Yeah, it's pretty cool. I took it to uh, Las Nunas, Blaine, uh, Santa Fe. Yeah, we ride, we've ridden it to Santa Fe several times and down to Blaine once right after they first started it, just to ride it. Yeah, Las Nunas. Then you got Acoma, you got all these stops on the way this way, San Felipe. Oh. All right, brother.
I'll let you go. Okay. He's Take it close. easy, okay? Have a good one. You too, brother. Thank you.